Papa Squat. I really need to start doing more albums, so uh, I am making sure to get one done this weekend. Uh, this is also a fairly short one. This is from Sewer Person, who we've been listening to a number of tracks from this last week under the name of Nine Tales. And uh, this is Dream Hopping, the full album. Andrea, Andrea, I don't know how you pronounce it, uh, sent in some money for me to react to this a while ago. I was looking at my uh, list of um, albums that I have to listen to, and I have, I have people who have paid me money from back in August that I haven't gotten around to their albums, so I need to catch up on albums, and I will be trying to do that over the next couple of weeks to months, because I have a number of them to do. Um, let's jump into this. It's about 30 minutes long, 21 minutes long, it looks like, and uh, I'm imagining it's going to be pretty good. I've got genius information up over here. Uh, I can move this over. All, apparently every single track on here has a super long name. Uh, the first one is Things Fly at You at a Billion Miles Per Hour by Sewer Person and Eric Godlow. Let's see if there's some lyrics for this. There are! This album came out in 2020. Uh, I want to see what they call this. Rap. That's all it is, is rap. I'm imagining it is not just rap. Uh, let's check it out. Things fly at you at a billion miles per hour from Sewer Person and Eric Adlow. <laughs> I love that voice in the background. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like, it's, it's, yes, it is entirely distracting, and yet it creates the entire basis background for the song, and it sounds really, really unique and interesting. Um, not saying it's like a flippin' fantastic song, but it sets up the album in a way that tells you it's going to be a rap album, it's going to be pretty experimental, it's going to not sound like you maybe expect most rap albums to sound like. Uh, the lyrics are very, very cool. Brace the walls, water falls to the sound of static, scent of acid, a book of spells in a seal of magic. Bad habits, a broken noose, and some burning matches. Box springs under me as the fox sings. Soft strings from Eric the Earthling. Thoughts glisten, the process is too efficient. The rhythm is pot licking, I'm serving you deep dishes. Damn. That's amazing. And then the outro says, that's the intro. <laughs> This is a folk song from the settlement on the edge of the earth, produced by Eric Gottlob. of his when he gets into the ah, and really forces some power out of himself. It's so good. Uh, very emo-y sounding. Not particularly rap sounding in my opinion. This sounds very, very much like an alternative pop, nah, pop song. Alternative um, style of song. It, 
is it's not triggering a lot of rap to me at all. Uh, there is a nice beat in the background, except for in the very beginning. Uh, absolutely digging this, though. It's such a good sounding song. Okay, I think that's that's the most significant line in here, I think. Uh, so it's interesting because he talks about um, uh, Baby Are You Human had to tell her that I might be. Least when she found out she couldn't tell me I was lying. And if I told you everything, so he could maybe not be human. Um, and if I told you everything, you'd look at me like mind freak. I don't, I don't necessarily think that's true. I don't think if you told everybody every single thought you had every single day, if somebody were honest, they would say, I may not have had that exact thought, but I have thought something equally as messed up and weird or strange or like unexpected that you would never think that somebody would think because so many thoughts go through your head and um, this sort of thinking of like, no, you, you think I'm a freak. Like I'm just, I'm just a weird, weird person. Like who's not like anybody else. It's just, it's just not true. I mean, you are completely unique. You only have your own experiences to base your existence on, but everybody has weird thoughts. Everybody, anybody who has a thinking brain has weird thoughts. Um, but the thing that I thought was really cool here is he says, baby, I'm from 20 fucking million miles away and you don't, uh, and you ain't even thanking me for showing up. Yeah. So the, uh, the idea of that is so good. Like I am, and, and especially because I know some of the background with sewer person and, uh, his issue, his like mental health issues and the fact that he talks about them a lot in his music is he's basically saying like I have made a huge effort just to show up and be human and 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 you think that's like the like the a given and it's so not for me like it takes me work to just engage with people on a real like what you consider a normal level that is a really cool, cool lyric to include in a song because I'm sure a lot of people would listen to that and go, damn straight. And I'm sure there are also people who would go as like, yeah, it takes you, like, you shouldn't get thanked for just showing up and being a decent human being. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes you should because you're not mentally there all the time to do that necessarily. Uh, this is great. Guitar. 
not hard rock, but definitely rock. This is 36,000 un feet underwater in the western Pacific. Okay, so the start of this song is just another amazing example of lyrics telling us exactly what this guy is feeling in a way that sounds well cool and interesting and strange at the same moment familiar but alien i'm locked sorry i'm locked inside my head totally makes sense absolutely a normal line of words that you understand i'm locked inside my head unconsciously conscious and even that moves a little bit further away from making sense like the first line did but you get it like unconsciously conscious so you're conscious but you're unconsciously conscious of it and wraith walking shadow me men ah that's he's a sh he's a wraith walking Oh, it's, it's so good. It's so good and so really kind of obvious and subtle at the same time. I, just, I love what he does with lyrics and how he expresses himself, especially when it comes to like how he's feeling about things, how he thinks about things, and it just comes across so perfectly. And that voice. Fuck me. Mm. so good just sounds amazing too and it gets a little more abstract as it goes along right like he talks about some definite things in the beginning after all we do it for the screen time whoa 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 walking and i love the this kind of stuttering to the music we're walking to the uh to the plug i'm on a beeline whoa 2 a.m mcdonald's uber eats whoa 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 3 a.m i never get my me time whoa whoa she put me in my uh no she just put my sheets beneath the sea line whoa i don't know what that means and then I, I, I just racked my brain removing landmines. Whoa, expect my waves connecting to my family through the phone. It, I, I mean, it, it's sure, okay, I, starting to make some sense. I see what you're saying about connecting to your family through my phone, through your phone, and then XX expect the unexpected. I might never leave my home. Expect the added tension where I step inside my zone. Th 36. No, 30 is 60. The perk dissolve in the Schweppes. This murky uh, water could fix me. I'm zipping down my Giuseppe. Clothes depress me when I'm sweaty. My scales just rip at the fleece. My scales just rip at the fleece. Yeah, like he's a monster. He's just like a 
dinosaur or some weird creature. I'm exposed to the devil. I say a prayer for I sleep. Whoo! 36,000 feet underwater in the Western Pacific. So what is that supposed to be? What is that supposed to mean? That's how he feels? That's... I don't know. And he says 30 is 60, but no, not 36,000. Interest, really interesting track. Sounds super cool. Very kind of laid back and surreal-ish in a way. Uh, let's move on to the next track. I really enjoy his stuff. It is so good. The fourth track is Cool Fighting Scene from Your Favorite Show. <laughs> Night, you don't wanna touch me. Alright, oh, bye. I won't take the bait when I see it, baby. I can give you everything, I'm just a human. Oh, why? Why you always try to fight? Okay, I might call you over and like, oh, hey. Then I'm flying around you like I'm just say, Baby, I could do this shit like, all day. That's okay, we girl. I'm getting so nice. sick of you. And I think it's about time we headed back home. I'm sick of this party. Felt like 20 hours before I really got started. But every time I save, I'm gonna always get carded. If I think I have my night, it's over for a start. It's been such a long time, such a long time. Okay, I gotta stop. This first verse is. Uh, the lyrics are absolutely amazing. He's talking about, like, the stuff he thinks about when he's going out uh, or, or and dealing with his girlfriend. Night, you don't want to talk, then all right. Bite, I won't take the bait when I see it, baby. I can't give you everything. I'm just a human. Yeah, you can't give somebody everything. It's, you are just human. Like, you can't make their life perfect. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. There, there's too much history there for you to make it right, quote unquote. Why you always try to fight? Okay, I might call you over then, like Olay. <laughs> then I'm flying around you like I'm Sensei, baby. I could do this like do this shit like all day. It's if it's okay with you, girl. I'm getting so sick of you, and I think it's about time we headed back home. I'm sick of this party. Felt like 20 hours before it really got started. Yeah, for somebody who has like social anxiety, that's exactly what it feels like. Everything just becomes too much. I can't, I can't even deal with my girlfriend. She's so, she just drives me crazy sometimes because I'm in a different situation than we normally are in, and it takes a lot out of me. And so I'm impatient. Like that's what he's telling us, right? Baby, I could do this shit like all day. If that's okay with you, then girl, the, the very next lie, girl, I'm getting sick of you and I think it's about time we headed back home. I'm sick of this party. Felt like 20 hours before it really got started. Uh, that's just an amazing rhyme too. And every time I shave, I know I'm going to get carded. So he's thinking about that too. Like, ah, I had to shave to go out to this party and I know I'm going to get carded and I'm not 18 years old anymore. Why am I getting carded? If I ain't think ahead, my night is over before it started. Ugh. Exactly. Because I have to think about how to be a human being out in the world. It's amazing. It's amazing how much stuff he just blah, puts out. And and it's not hard to figure out, right? Like that That is not hard to puzzle through and come up with what he's trying like what he's going through just to go out to a party with his friends in theory his friends and his girlfriend that's <laughs> uh, so good uh, i think i read like 36 intelligence society sorry i gotta back up because there was a pretty significant switch in the style of music i think i have my night is over for a start it's I'm 
through some of this too it's been such a long time such a long time i think i read like 36 intelligent societies among the midnight sky no clue what that means it made me feel all right i feel all right and honestly it's not 100p of me 100 percent of me i tap into the others whoa turn it up <laughs> this was actually it sounded really good if you love me then hold me tight i was on thinning ice like, a, he just wants reassurance, right? Like, just hold me and just make me feel like I matter. Man, I'm getting sick of this world. I don't want to live this boring life. I just had a dream about a feeling I had never felt before, and now I miss it almost every night. Crazy. Such a good... How do you have a, how do you have a dream about a feeling you've never had before? about a feeling you've never had before. You'd have to, I don't even know how you would feel that, right? Sometimes in our lives, it takes the worst of things to teach us what to do when no one else will help you fight. Yeah. It's, I mean, you need to fight your own battles, especially if they're mental, right? Nobody else can really get in there and help you with that. Whew. This is a brave freaking guy. He just absolutely has to get this stuff out of his head in order to to work, to to operate. And it's incredible because it it lets everybody else who hears this music go, I understand that feeling even if I don't have it all the time. I know what he's talking about. Sometimes you don't want to live this fucking boring life. It's always this right here. It's this view. It never changes. It's always your eyes and ears and everything. Like, it's always the same thing. There's no editing of anything. There's no cutting and swiping to another scene that's more exciting than you sitting on the fucking toilet. Like, <laughs> it's this all the time. Your two eyes absolutely amazing I love this stuff it's so good and it sounds so good and comfortable even though it's very personal and real and raw and honest it's pretty amazing the next song is excerpt from a book I found in the woods this guy's crazy awesome Okay, so that's interesting, because there have been a couple of... Okay, so that was the end of that track. Okay, so uh, that interference that came in, that static. Uh, there was one or two points where that came in during the song, too, and I wondered if that was supposed to be, like, like disassociating or, like, a weird interference in his brain of, like, thoughts coming in that he wasn't trying to have that weren't included in... in thought process of the song even though they came in as like little weird bursts of information um, but maybe that's going to stick just to that one song we'll see if it I wouldn't be surprised at all if that static stuff started showing up in the rest of the album <laughs> Carry me away 
life, fuck it, here, lift me away My mind is reaching the limit, though I really love to say Thoughts in my pleasure, for me, my tiny fate Hit a price from the party, but I ain't had that much to say She said it was cute and it's okay I don't know you, and so I go away That's just about as far as I can take I guess you just gotta say it like, this machine, they jammed up If you love me, why you always got the fans up? She said it's about time you man up I think it's about time we wake up Dreams don't bring themselves into fruition on your day off Just got on my corner I smoke this with furnace and I go numb same stuff right like the first the, the intro is interesting and again I could read through every single line of every single song and it, but it's just amazing because there's so much meaning in all of this right the skies above me cry out gray I went ahead and burnt it all today it was never meant to go this way I was supposed to keep you safe oh it's a big world, so much you could dream up. Yeah, she maxed out the uh, maxed out the shower and get the steam up. Yeah, I got a small brain, not too much to think of. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not so smart. Could you teach me what it's made of? Yeah, carry me away, fucking airlift me away. My mind has reached its limit, though it's, I'd really love to stay. Like, I, I can't deal with this anymore. I've I'm out of spoons, right? My mind has reached its limit, though I'd really love to stay. Indulging in my pleasures before I meet my timely fate. <laughs> That's just what I'm doing with my life. I'm just doing what I enjoy until I die. She had approached me at the party, but I ain't have that much to say. She said it was cute and it's okay. So a girl comes up to him to talk to him at a party and he can't even... Bleh. Can't, can't do anything, right? No, no, you mistook my go away. And that's... <laughs> and that's just about as forward as I can take. I guess you just gotta stay like old cog... Uh, sorry. Yeah, I just... I guess you gotta stay like old cogs, cogs power this machine. They jammed up. So my... Me, I'm jammed up. I, I don't work right. If you love me, why you always got the fence up? Like, don't make it harder than it has to be. She said, it's about time you man up. Yeah, just get toughen up, loser. I think it's about time we wake up. Dreams won't bring themselves into fruition on your day off. Crystals scatter my coal nugs. I'm, uh, I don't think that's the correct lyrics. I smoke this wood furnace and I go numb. All day on the road. So he's just talked about all this stuff, like how hard it is, right? He's home, he's with his girl, you can infer that he's at home, he's with his girlfriend. It's hard, because she's defensive all the time, even though he's not trying to make her defensive, he's just trying to be, and she gets offended, or she is just very defensive, or she thinks he's saying bad things about her, and so she responds with that same energy, and he's just being him he does he doesn't want that back but then he says all day on the road all night i'm missing home so really no matter where he is he's not going to be happy right because if he's at home things are not great and if he's away he just wants to be home he wants to be back where things are comfortable but they're not really that comfortable late night she's on her own she's still an angel on the phone so maybe it's okay to be away if she's just that amazing when you're not there and you're just talking on the phone like that sounds okay even though it's not okay so good all night I'm missing home late night she's on her own she's an angel I'm on the phone all day can't even feel us Forgive me, my face is falling off. 
Oh, I want hear no screaming as my human rise. Soon enough, I'll touch your head and I'll consume your thighs. It's funny just how long it took to start wearing off. Throw my feet to rockets and I swap my hands for table size. Why is that called excerpt from a book I found in the woods? Alright, so that's the end of that one. Excerpt from a book I found in the woods. I don't know why. Uh, the next track is track six, Your Place Sucks. At least the ghost ship is comfy. That's a good that's a good name, gotta admit. which I'm not sure if they got correct completely. Sailor waves, fog touch, tailored inhalers. Captain, I can't breathe on these stormy nights. Tentacles climb inside the boat into my reticle. Pitiful, he's gone. Uh, sorry, pitiful, he's gonna, like, going to. Gonna eat us up like we was pigeon food. Shadows inside my eyelids. I'm passing through uninvited. I'm curiously... I curiously decided to venture into the void, even if I was silent approaching an anti-violence. The creature suppresses the noise. They've taken away the choice. Away the choice. Whew. It's 4 a.m. on Venice Beach, and I still fucking miss you. I look into the water and see it, you in the crystals. Here I come. What's this water on my waist do? Yeah, in the rush, I go to breathe like I had meant to, yeah, alright, I want to get higher, yeah, pitch black, but the flame from the light, but the flame from the lighter, yeah, thumbtacks in my hands, they're on fire, yeah, one day she's going to stop loving, yeah, really some confusing stuff going on there, it's 4am on Venice Beach and I still fucking miss you, okay, I look into the water and see you in the crystals, okay, so you see her face, here I come, so that, that line doesn't mean anything until you get to the w next line. What's What this water on my waist do? So he's apparently walked into the water at this point, up to the, his waist. Yeah, in the rush, I go to breathe like I had meant to. Yeah. And I wonder if he's just walking into the water and drowning, or if he, like, the 
water makes him <laughs> breathe. Like, I have no idea what's going on here. All right, I just want to just get higher. And then the last, the outro, blue trees surround me. God of war, God of war, God of war. I'm, I'm not sure they got those lyrics right in Genius. I would love to explore. I see fog coming in from the waves on the shore. Totally, totally lost on me. I'm really not sure about that one. Uh, so that was Your Place Sucks. At least the ghost ship is comfy. Next is I See Fireflies Through Our Tent. I see fireflies through our tent. Oh, that's interesting, Homer. This is this is another album that you just listen to when you are sad, depressed, lonely, feeling bad, and you just and you're okay with it. You you just you feel like I just want I just want to enjoy the feeling of being a loser and not not feel bad about it. I just, I want to be okay with how I feel even if I don't feel good. And if you've never felt like that, you are a lucky, lucky person. And if you do, you know exactly what I'm talking about. I just want to, I just want to enjoy being... <sighs> Meh. This album is amazing for that. It would be amazing. You could just sit back and be with this music. That is what this whole album is for, I think. I have to jump in here again because the lyrics are st still just freaking amazing. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. But I don't understand for once. I'm not her oxygen. And when the trees stand... Oh, this is just an amazing line. And when the trees stand bare and thirsty. I, it, I mean, that's probably just the fall or the winter, right? But the trees stand bare and thirsty. And when the leaves fall down to earth, with my hands all scraped and dirty, can you bring me back my worth? <sighs> it's a real long time till tomorrow. I think we should try to work out all the kinks. Which is a hilarious line, because it doesn't fit at all. I think we should try to work out all the kinks. It sounds completely out of place, and yet it is an absolutely natural thing to say. And, and that even makes it more interesting, because it's a line that... You could hear any like let's try to work out the kinks like let's figure it out but it doesn't fit quite right here because it sounds so normal and the rest of his language is so not i just want to spend some time with you but it feels like it's borrowed that is easily the best line so far in this in this song 
I want to spend time with you, but I feel like it's borrowed time. Like it's, it's going to end. It's not, this isn't going to work. We're, it's not going to last. Girl, help me out because I do not know what to think. <laughs> I, j I just hope the guy finds a girlfriend who gets him and he's able to enjoy it because, wow, hard, hard to deal with that all the time. I mean, for him to deal with all the time, to feel like that and to think like that. And he's super talented. So that was I see fireflies through our tent, and the next one is the sunken de the sunken city debacle. Also just noticing there's almost no songs on here I think maybe the first one had a bit of a beat but there's almost no song on here despite the fact that this is a rap album right that has like a, a, a real drum beat that is central to the song like none of them so far I think maybe one And there's a drum line. Oh, yeah. good again and more issues with his girlfriend right i got ammo i got trigger words to say when she get mad at me so i know what to i know what to say to make her angry people feast on bouts of public negativity and doctor i don't like that look you i don't like that look you got but give it to me honestly if i fear for my life i guess release could bring serenity <sighs> Yeah, that's <laughs> that's a way of looking at it. If I if I'm afraid of for my life all the time, then when I'm finally dead, how relaxing that will be. For my life, I guess release could bring serenity. Baby, what's the point in all this touching if I gotta keep my clothes on? Yeah, and he ends on that exact line, right? So let's see, float on baby, what's the point of all this touching if I gotta keep my clothes on? Every time I'm walking home from yours, I had to act like I was no one. Told me, <clears throat> wrap my hand inside her hair after she tell me I gotta hold on. Sorry if I hesitate, I haven't felt these feelings I got inside. All that remains in this sunken city tragedy how can he sleep when people turn to savagery? I just want to talk, tell him I just want to speak. Rest of hidden face. 
gonna get him in his sleep. I got ammo, I got trigger words to say when she get mad at me. People feast on public bouts of negativity and doctor, I don't like the way you look at me. Uh, is, I don't like that look you got, but give it to me honestly. Wow, that is a really hard line to say for me for some reason. If I fear for my life, I guess release could bring Seren. And that's the end of the song. So good. So good. So good. Uh, what was that? The Sunken City debacle. Next is It's a Cruel, Cruel World. <laughs> This makes me laugh because <laughs> he's kind of been saying that the entire time. I get the feeling that this should be turned into like a claymation style animated short that uses this music and has shows some little Wallace and Gromit style character, I guess it would be Wallace, not Gromit, playing the piano with this sort of sound going on in the background. And I have no idea where this is going to go, but that's the thing that jumps into my head. Looking at myself in a mirror, what a monster I load it up and then I eat it like it's not worse I can't open up, I gotta fiddle with a lock first What's the point of climbing when you worry if the drop hurts? I just slipped outside inside my Nikes Rain and call my shit and I could hear them laughing at me I see all my forms like 2014 with an acne I'm not gonna hurt them, am I lying, bitch, I might be I just slid that boy into reality I just bent his mind and made him crave his own fatality. No. This is the most rapish song on this album. His flow, his style, the drum beat. It's got a little bit of piano in the background, which is neither here nor there in terms of turning it into a, a rap song. But this is definitely the most rap ish song on the entire album. And it's very, very good. It really adds a new feel to this whole album, and it's great. I can hear them laughing at me. I see all my forms like 2014 with an acne. I'm not gonna hurt them. Am I lying, bitch? I might be. I just slid that boy into reality. I just bent his mind and made him crave his own fatality. No. Looks like everything about my salary. Yeah, you got the weekend, but the rest you live in hourly. Check, check. Yeah, I got a check, break red. Half of it went to the mess, and a rest put a polo pony right on top of my chest. It's a flex, it's a flex. I got on it, Royal York, like I was living in a rest. And I couldn't get it. I hate the beef, but I eat it up if you gonna bread it. You got to drink and incessant shit, told me to forget it. I wish I could, but my memory gonna know you said it. I go to sleep, hoping catching seeds gonna give me leverage. When I'm asleep, it's a lucid dream about what I'm forgetting. I'm drinking up when I'm smoking up, knowing I'll regret it. I'm passing out when I'm throwing up like I need a medic. song is going to be the most energetic on the album. 
the most upbeat. And this is called It's Over, You Can Go Home. And what I'm what I'm hoping he's doing, and maybe he won't, maybe he won't, maybe it'll just be like I said, it'll just be an it'll be a whole album that's about making you feel fine about feeling bad. And I think the next song is gonna this song that we're gonna listen to next is gonna be the most positive on here because that song was a very different style. The one we just finished was a very different style and really did seem a little more, like it had a little more energy to it, right? And I'm really curious about this next one, if it's going to end on a high note and like kind of be like, okay, you, you made it through this feeling that you're having and now let's do something. And however, the title is "It's Over." You can go home. So that it's that is non-specific. It does not give me a clue of it being positive or negative. But it it could go either way. It could just finish out this whole thing with like, "Yep, you're doing okay. You're you made it through this. Now, now, it's your time. Like, do what you need to do." Uh, so let's check it out. It's over. You can go home. Sewer person. Not a lot of energy yet. having listened to this album for having it made it all the way through for it like for for enduring his his, his what he had to say no his, i appreciate your tolerance if this is how it ends well i'm glad you were a part of it it's like shakespeare if we spirits have offended think but this is and all is mended this was all inside my head before i got around to starting it you made it to the end, and I appreciate your tolerance. Really, in my brain, inside my head, and that is it. Really, I'm my brain inside my head, and that is it. These holograms around me somehow willing me to live. And I know I can't touch you, I mean really, really can't, uh, really touch you. On atomic level shit, but that's not how we're made to feel. If you look at people walking, everybody moves the same, perfect mesh of flesh and bone equipped with total mental rain. When you think about it really, only difference is the brain. So that's why I'm looking through you when I'm talking to your face. Please don't be scared, there's nothing for me to think about. It's over now, I'm sober now, I power down. <sighs> so good. <laughs> Yeah. 
just amazing. Just an amazing, amazing album. And not... I'm so glad that you rightly sent this to Andrea, sent this to me to listen to as a whole, because individual songs, yep, absolutely great. I mean, that I would listen to any song on here, and there are a couple that are complete standouts for me. But to listen to this all in a row, and to actually hear and watch and read the lyrics, and just his whole... the journey he goes on throughout this entire thing is so good it's so perfect it's such a great feeling album mm. catching up because she told me we can speak now we can talk we can talk again i keep my lights on when i sleep now i keep my phone on when you go out i don't go out with you because when i fall asleep you're the one i dream about Brought a black Nikon to the beach house. Pull my fleece out when I feel the breeze out. Used to freak. Now you're too busy to go out. I don't know if that's supposed to be like you used to freak like have sex or freak out. But now you're, you're too busy to go out. Throw my dreams out. All I do is sleep now. That sounds like depression. So he doesn't end on an up, right? But he, he doesn't end necessarily on a down. He just is... This is where I'm at. This is what I'm doing. Thank you for being here for to watch this all unravel. It wasn't anything before I started working on it and except thoughts in my head and now it's this album and thank you for being here. <sighs> so good. Really crazy crazy good. Absolutely love it. Downloading this 100% going on my favorites. <laughs> so good. I love it. Papa Squat checking out please like subscribe and share if you have something you'd like me to react to please send me information or leave it in the comments uh if you send me money i will for sure do it if you leave it in the comments i will maybe hopefully get around to it because i get a lot of recommendations from people this is an amazing album i hope you all enjoyed it i really really did really did have a good night and a happy halloween tomorrow